All right, so I just got my uh, Terop 2D, T2D, came in today, and I'm going to do an unboxing, so that way uh, a lot of people are going to buy this, get an idea of what's inside the box, what to expect. So what we have here is uh, a little stands-off plastic with tiny screw. The controller bore and uh, the mount. It's just left behind the GoPro 3. And this is the gimbal. You can see they, they close on this size and it's open on this size. So you can't really do a uh, 360 turn. It's only 180 turn. See, like right there. Okay, and this one here you can turn it freely. Okay, uh, these are aluminum, aluminum, and seem pretty pretty good. The cable is right inside the arm. Okay, you can see it. It turned pretty free. Uh, this thing here is pretty good also. And this route inside the cable, uh, I mean this aluminum arm. Okay, they have two screw on top there for you to screw it in. This is the uh, USB cable to load the firmware to do all the adjustment. I think this is FDIT uh, type of thing instead of a USB. I don't know. I could be wrong because it's for for uh, conductor instead of a you know you um, serial serial. I have it three. Okay, so there it is. I, I could be wrong. Maybe a serial. I don't know. I'll take a look inside. Uh, these are for uh, each cable for controlling pitch, tilt, and roll and stuff like that. Just typical servo cable. And this one here is one end you have three, and the other end you have uh, probably ground and tilt and roll. And last but not least, this uh, plate. Gotta throw away this staple. We got carpet, so I don't want it to be on the carpet. See, this is uh, a plate. Uh, damper, pretty tiny damper and stands off another stand off this is our aluminum and the hanger okay oh and I thought this is uh, what you would call uh, aluminum but this is plastic so it's easy to break so be careful there it looked like aluminum on online because it's the shiny plastic but after all it is plastic okay and oh, get what? A manual. Cool. I read that many of you didn't even have a manual. But it uh, looks like this is the sample, it's simply uh, manual. They show where to connect, what to connect, and all. So that's it. Alright, so um, I'm going to put this together and and see how it goes, but I heard a lot of great things about it, uh, but don't know how it goes yet. But uh, I'm gonna put this together and fly it and see. And I have uh, I flew this morning with my Vector DD. Pretty happy. It's very stable, very very smooth. They keep the horizon pretty good too. But uh, let's see if this can keep up with the Vector DD. All right, see ya.